Hey everybody, Spoonfed here and we're going to do some more programming. Uh, first let me fix this. That's the doc type declaration for um, HTML5, so that's relatively easy. Um, so let me fix that here as well. So, alright, um, what are we going to do? Well, in the old days, <clears throat> like in the very old days, in the early 90s, when this was uh, HTML was like brand new for the internet and browsers and stuff, um, the, the way you would design your page would be with a table layout. Um, and I'm, I was, in my mind, I was going back and forth between if I should do that or not. And I decided on not, no, I'm not going to do that. Um, because what you do is you make this one big table, as it were. Um, uh, how can I best describe that? Well, this was one big table, and then you would have a, a, a row here at the top that would hold your title, and you would have a row um, like below that that would be compartmentalized that would have your navigation, and then below that you would have a box here that would have your content, for example, a box here that would have your content, and a box here, and a box there, and so on, so on, so on. But everything was built up with a table. And I'll probably do something with, with a table, but it's best to avoid that. And I'm going to make my site ready for some uh, CSS that we're going to do. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to use the div equivalent, so that's dividers. Uh, so we have a, a, a header section with h1, which we could just position somewhere later on, but here we'll do a a div and we'll end that div right there so what will happen on the page? well nothing really except if you look at it uh, you look at the HTML it would have a div there and div there it's now its own block as it were that's how you should see it, its own block so we got a image there. We'll do uh, about page, and we'll do a contact page. So we'll sign, do it like so. Reload. So all right. So this is our basic navigation. It doesn't do anything yet, as of yet, but that's our navigation. The only thing that bothers me is everything is aligned to the left which is not that bad because that's how we read but the navigation I would kind of want in the center as well as my title so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna center this one we're gonna center this div so center like that All right. now in my OCD makes me do this um, like so no sorry that's incorrect it's like so like so like so why do I do this it's easier for me to read um, don't know if it's easier for you to read, but right now I can see, or I have a body tag that lines up. Yep, yeah, it lines up. A header tag lines up. Center tag lines up. H1, yes. Center to center, div to div, image, close. Yeah, so I can. It's real easy for me to see everything in one, one go, as it were. Uh, you could do the footer as well. You could do the footer like so, actually, if you would wish like that which uh, basically it's okay it's the same All right so now we have everything cool in the center oh yeah baby baby now let's let's just pretend we have an about page and a contact page and we'll just link this stuff so we'll leave that image standing there because that's our home image that's, that's fine um, I'm stealing that off another site, but that's that's how we roll on the internet. You could like download this image, 
Uh, let me, you know what? We'll, we'll do that. That sounds like a good plan. Um, we're going to do this. Here, 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 there. Save. I'm going to go into our project folder, which is here, there, there. And here we're going to link it to. Like so. So it should be alright. But now it has a new few image info. See, now it goes here and not it does not link all the way to another page. As you can see. So we fixed that. Alright, so let's just make it as though that were something so we'll do this call this home which is basically index.html and we'll end that there the about will do well let's call that about html and contact we'll call that very surprisingly contact.html So we're gonna save that. We're gonna reload, and now you can see everything's linkable. But this image is also linkable. So this one goes here. This one will give us an error because it cannot find that, and this one gives us an error because it cannot find that either. But that's okay. And that one links out to our site or my site in this case. So um, let's center this footer as well. So we'll have everything centered except for. Um, the text so we'll have everything sent except for the text which is cool and so now we have a div area here it's one block we're gonna make this a div area because we want um, that to be a div and the footer will um, leave that as it is actually because we can the footer is already class on its own as well as the header so we can like in CSS we can say header class for example and we'll just you know it's because it's a tag and we can give the style to divs we can also give the style to footers or centers or P or A or H1 or whatever so um, I'll do it like so. Nothing changes except we gave this its own block of code. Um, what I'm also going to do is I'm going to introduce a H2, which will be right there. Well, it will also be a center one. So we center one H2 navigation navigation. And we need to close that one like so. So this is a bit redundant, but just want to show you how easy it is to make your site a bit well cool layout. This one, of course, looks weird now, but that's okay. Also, I want to introduce another tag, which is a break tag, um, and we're gonna introduce one after this one and after that one or before this one so whatever you want to see it. so we'll do it after that one so we'll do it here break and we'll do it here break basically what it adds is extra lines so it adds a white line and a white line here and I must be honest I'm gonna remove that navigation because it looks God damn ugly. Right, so we'll do it like that. That looks fun. Alright, so yeah, that's it enough for this time. Uh, I'm gonna keep this video short because I wanna just progress through it slowly and but surely as it were. Um, 
and I've not really thought about design or layout or what I want to do with the actual site I know what it needs to do though that's the, the gist of it um, so yeah that's uh, it for the center tag very nice tag to use uh, the div tag and the break tag and that's about it I think I covered it yeah so and uh, oh by the way if you want to make that character it's usually it's a pipeline character and it's usually above the the like the right enter button uh, or left if you want to call it with the numpad um, it's usually above the uh, backslash or uh, forward slash sorry no, no I'm confused no backslash and that one proves this character which I quite like in separating things so basically that's it for yeah that's it for this tutorial as it were you just running along with me doing all kinds of stuff in HTML so we updated this one as well oh yeah that's one we updated the decoration type and do we need to update anything here on the skeleton no I don't believe we need to do that well we could do actually no I'm gonna add one uh, title title because you every site needs a title you don't need a title of course but that will be weird so go ahead with the title and that's it because otherwise this will be read probably file C user spoon fat HTML and Excel HTML and that's not what I want so that's it for this week's HTML.